Why should the five of us believe that this business is going to be successful? Killer Whales is a younger version of Shark Tank. I'm going to be able to tell you right away if this is good or not. Mixed with America's Got Talent. I'm going to swim with that. Thank you. With a little bit of UFC. And I also would be willing to pay you to headbutt Mario when this is over. So I've been a producer and director in the TV industry now for something like 15 years. I've worked with some of the biggest names in the industry, worked in some of the biggest shows. And what I couldn't believe was that there wasn't a crypto TV show that kind of focused on all of the things that we see online every day, good or bad, and brought it all together into must-see television. Every founder that talks like them has been successful. So I just, I don't, Facts. you know. That's it. Yep. What can you expect from killer whales? Something really interesting about our whale panel is there are experts from all walks of life, politicians, crypto native people, finance people, NFT people. So many different types of judges are on our show. It, there's something for everybody. I've just had that penny drop moment. They, they're actually not selling water. They're just selling they experiences. They are the next Disney. We scoured the whole world to find the most diverse projects that would be perfect for the show. We have a great partnership with CoinMarketCap and they were our main search partner. For us, it was a no-brainer. Um, CoinMarketCap is the home of crypto. It's often the place where millions of people begin their crypto journey. As a show, Killer Whales has very similar aims. Uh, it's a really, really entertaining way to introduce millions of people around the globe to this crazy, fascinating world of Web3 and crypto. How does it feel to be on Killer Whales? So these projects come on, they give their best pitch to the whales. Please pitch us your game. This aims to be the number one play and own blockchain game. Then the whales go right into an AMA. Ask me anything. How much of your own money have you invested into this? I put $10 million of my own money. Are you on drugs? Once we get through all that, the judges have got to make a decision. It's sink or swim time. Will they sink? If you're gonna get defensive with me, how are you gonna talk to your community? I'm gonna sink. Or will they swim? With me, you swim. This show is not biased either way. We wanna show you the projects in the rawest way possible, and we want you to decide, do you agree with the whales? Do you not agree with the whales? Is this a quality project? Is this something I wanna look into more? If you wanna succeed, you need to be a killer. I think what's really important to note is that the show is not about investing. No money changes hands, the whales do not invest in the projects. Instead, it's about shining a light on some of the projects that potentially have been overlooked by the industry and giving them a chance in the spotlight and have the killer whales ask them the hard-hitting questions. Why should I think this is going to succeed? I almost feel like you've got one foot in the coffin and the other one in a, on a banana peel. Just as a coin market cap, we like to make uh, crypto accessible and easy through our website and our app. So Killer Whales is introducing the world to crypto and Web3 in a really entertaining, accessible way uh, for people at home all over the world who just want to watch a great show and learn something about crypto on the way. The concept of Killer Whales is literally just closing a knowledge gap. You've saved users over $5 million Correct. That's huge. Let's understand the world of Web3 a little better, and let's make it a safe place for people to come into and wade in from the shallow end rather than jump in the deep end. And out of all the founders we've talked to, you have the most passion. I think that is easily picked up by your community. When they see that, they're going to stick with you. It's been great working with Hello Labs. I mean, they're obviously experts in making really entertaining, really fun content. We're experts in making crypto accessible to the world. So it really felt like a, a perfect match. So for me, what really spoke to me the most about the whole Killer Whales and the Hello Labs folks was that they took the time to actually look into these projects. They took the time to look into everybody that's involved in the show and make sure that we were operating with a sense of integrity. I think you're too nice in a cutthroat industry. I do agree with Mario just a little bit. You need to be more aggressive. What I want people to take away is that crypto isn't just about the technology, it's about the people. What's your passion? The passion comes from a pain that I'm suffering. I, I'm currently living in my sister's basement. It's about their stories. It's about where they've come from, what they're building, and where they're going. I want to help you. I want to mentor you, just to get your pitch right. Because I think that you actually do have the spirit, but you just don't know how to communicate it properly. It's a swim.